Hello world, Techno Sleuth Craig Chamberlain here. I'm uh, really happy to have you guys swinging by and checking out this Hello World series. The whole purpose of this uh, Hello World se series is to teach basic to intermediate uh, computer users how to properly maintain their computers and uh, get them to a point where after it's all set up, they can essentially do a routine monthly maintenance and not really worry about a whole lot of slowdown issues associated with Trojans and viruses. So what I'm going to go ahead and do here real quick is I'm going to show you at my website all the software we're going to discuss in the following, you know, I think it's up to nine episodes now, but they'll probably keep adding on. The following nine episodes are available at my website under in the bottom right hand corner under free maintenance software. Um, we're going to talk about advanced system care. We're going to talk about AVG free. We're going to talk about malware bytes, smart defrag, spybot, super anti spyware, quite a bit of tools that are out there. They're all free. Everything is available for free on the internet right now. Most tools, unless you're doing real extensive, dirty and important work, then uh, this is going to clean up pretty much most of your computers. Now, uh, again, the website is uh, pcmichiana.com, www.pcmichiana, and that's going to redirect you to download.com, which has really quick download speeds. That's why I don't host them myself. Plus, they're all scanned with uh, antivirus, and you can basically trust them, and they'll always have the most recent version posted. Now, also, I encourage all of you to swing by my actual channel on YouTube. You can click on my name if you're watching this on a standard YouTube video. You click on my username, PC Michiana in the upper, Michiana in the upper right hand corner. It'll redirect you to the channel, and I encourage you to subscribe. It really encourages me to keep making the videos when I know uh, people are enjoying them. Uh, leave reviews. I honestly want honest feedback, uh, whether it was useful or not. All my videos are going to be available in HD, so you can watch them all, and I'll have them sorted by playlist. So right now we're in the Hello World series HD, and uh, when eventually I'll have just uh, the playlist viewed, and all the series will be shown up here, and then uh, basically you can choose whichever series you want to watch. So. Without further ado, we're going to talk about creating a system restore point. Because uh, before we get started on actually doing virus removal and Trojan removal, sometimes it can start inadvert cause inadvertent side effects because the Trojans and viruses have damaged your computer. So before we actually start doing this, we're going to just do a restore point, and it's very, very straightforward. Click Start, and then click Programs, click on Accessories, and then click on System Tools, and then you're going to click System Restore. Now this is going to bring up a menu that allows you to create a restore point. Essentially, it's very straightforward. It gives you the instructions here on the left. It tells you, explains it a little better. Click create a restore point. Click next. Usually I put the date in here, such as August 22nd, 2009, and then I'll click create. And what it'll do is it'll say restore point has been created. And, uh, and in order to recover from it, then you do the exact same thing. Go to start and then do the restore point. And then when you go up to, uh, instead of creating, just to restore my computer to earlier time, click next. It's going to do a search. It's going to find all your previous restore points. And then you get to select the date. And then it actually gives you actually a nice little history list here of things you've done. And then you click next. And it will actually do a recovery of your system. So I'm going to go ahead and cancel at that point. That's pretty much it. I hope you all enjoy the series. And I hope you learn a lot from it. I know you're going to be a lot happier with your computers when you're